Hi to all. Today we are going to see about the demand access multiple access technique in satellite communication. The motivation of Dama. Can we apply medium access method from fixer networks? For example, CSME or CD that is carry sense multiple access with collision detection since as soon as the medium is free, listen into the medium if a collision occurs. If problem in wireless networks arises, signal strength decreases proportional to the square of the distance. The sender would apply carriage sense and collision detection method. But the collision happens at the receiver. It might be the case that the sender cannot hear the collision. Furthermore, carriage sense might not work if the terminal is hidden. Hidden and exposed terminals. Hidden terminals. For example, A sends to B. C cannot receive A. C wants to sense to B. C sends a free medium if carriage sense fails. Collision at B occurs. A cannot receive the collision because collision reduction fails. A is hidden for C. In exposed terminals, suppose B sends to A, C wants to sense to another terminal. C has to wait, carry signals a medium in use. But A is outside the radio range of C. Therefore, waiting is not needed. C is exposed to B. In the near and far terminals, terminals A and B sense C receives us. Signal strength decreases proportional to the square of the distance. The signal of terminal B therefore rounds out A signal. C cannot receive A's message. If C, for example, was an arbiter for sending right terminals, terminal B would round out terminal A already on the physical layer. Also, severe problem of CDMA network processes power requires needed. So different access methods are SDMA, FDMA, TDMA and DMA. SDMA that is space division multiple access in which segment spaces into sectors use directed antennas. The cell structure are different in SDMA. FDMA frequency division multiple access assign a certain frequency to a transmission channel between a sender and a receiver. Permanent, slow hopping and fast hopping are the different types of frequency hopping spread spectrum. TDMA In time division multiple access, it assigns the fixed sending frequency to a transmission channel between the users and the receiver for a certain amount of time. In DAMA, that is demand, demand assigned multiple access, the channel frequency, the channel efficiency is only 80% for Aloha. 36% for slotted aloha by assuming poison distribution for packet arrival and packet length. Reservation can increase efficiency to 80%. If a sender reserves a future time slot, the sending within this reserved time slot is possible without collision. The reservation also causes higher delays. The typical scheme for satellite link is demand assigned multiple access. The examples of, for reservation algorithms are explicit reservation according to Roberts, that is reservation aloha, implicit reservation, that is PRME, reservation TDME, access methods for DME, explicit reservation, the explicit reservation, that is reservation aloha, it is it works under two modes, aloha mode for reservation, competition for small reservation slots, collision is possible, in reservation mode for data transmission within successful reserved slots, no collision is possible. It is important for all stations to keep the reservation list consistent at any point in time and therefore all stations have to synchronize from time to time. The access methods PRME implicit reservation. PRME means packet reservation multiple access. In this a certain number of slots form a frame. Frames are repeated. Stations compete for empty slots according to the slotted aloha principle. Once a slide once a station receives a slot successfully, this slot is automatically assigned to this station in the in all following frames as long as the station has data to send. Competition for this slot starts again as soon as the slot was empty in the last frame. Access method for in DMA is reservation TDME. Reservation TD time division multiple access. In this every frame consists of n mini slots and x data slots. Every station has its own milli slot and can reserve up to k data slots using this mini slot. 
that is x equal to n into k. Other stations can send data in unused data slots according to a round robin sending scheme. From this we see about the demand access multiple access techniques in satellite communication. Thank you.